Greetings and welcome to my bench for uh, one of these rambling things that I do at the end of e each month. Uh, yeah, so January. It's been here and it's gone there. So it was a kind of a busy month, uh, modeling wise. I was finishing off the the Yagd Panzer IV from last year. Uh, the video is out on this already, as many of you uh, might already have seen. And uh, I had then had the group build of of building something with the with the word spit attached to it. So I built this Spitfire Mark uh, 14, I think it was. Spitfire Mark 14, 170 second scale. This is an ac academy kit, and uh, it came out all right, I guess. But I kind of lost interest in it when the decal started crapping up on me. Uh, and uh, didn't weather it as much as I usually do. But uh, it is what it is. And I'm, uh, I entered this into the group build, <laughs> anyways. So yeah, that's what I've done this month, and I've started the next project, I'll get to that later. Uh, when I had that group build stuff finished, I was gonna build this guy for the same group build, but I ended up tossing the kit into the bin, because it is a horrible kit, it's molding from 1963 I believe. And it had fit issues on every which way, so I just tossed it into the bin, like I said. And uh, I was gonna build that Spitfire Mark 1 that I showed you guys in the last rambling video, but um, after building the first Spitfire, I kind of just felt like building something else, so I, I'm trying to build uh, that drift missile that I've been talking about so much in every updates. I feel like for a long time now. Uh, I already have the unboxing video out and I've started building a little bit of it. It's the uh, it's this guy has a Gawa BMW 320i 124 scale limited edition. But we're not building it limited way, I think. We're just doing a stripped down race car interior. This is pretty much what I have done already got the uh, rear wing from the aftermarket set and uh, I've been doing a lot of thinking so I got the dash here and the seats aftermarket seat is a uh, likeness of the Recaro Profi SPG I guess it's called real racing seat and I've scratch built a seat, seat bracket for it so I can stick it in the car and yes, the design of these are the actual Recaro design, minus one bend in the in the uprights. And uh, yeah, we got a been doing a lot of thinking on this, and uh, there's a video being made, like I said. So uh, you better just watch that video to see what I've been thinking. And uh, new kits, yeah, that's next. I'm just doing a real quick update here um, I actually managed to stick by my guns and I have not bought a single kit in January however February is a uh, month where I celebrate my birthday so rest assured I have already ordered some stuff from Hobby Link Japan I got a big box coming with some stuff and the main Thing that I ordered is on back order so I guess I'll have that sometime later hopefully before uh, April <laughs> but they say they will uh, get it in like four to six weeks so yeah it's a long time to wait for one of my holy grail kits but anyways this has been my update for January uh, let's just keep it a short one and I'll catch you guys on the next one thanks for Sticking with me this long. Keep on modeling. Keep having fun. Bye.